This is the summary video of the Sonos M Power Drone and you'll be surprised that the Sonos M actually is capable of putting out even more power than the powerful Sonos Sub. The Sonos M is a very deep product. Deep in the sense that there is so much to talk about. The pros and the cons and all the beauty and the quirks of it. And I realized that when I posted a video of the Sonos M, I went on just a tad too long. So this video, we will dive right into the power test, if that's all you're interested to learn about. While performing the test, I almost burned out the voice call of the speakers I was testing the M with. There was a burning smell, and before I knew it, the plaster on the ceiling started to flake, and the white stuff was raining down from the ceiling. That's the kind of power that this little guy was putting out. So for now, let's get to the power draw test right away. You see, the Sonos Sub was powerful. It was one of the most loved products within the Sonos product range. Because of the amount of power that it was putting out, it actually adds a very solid foundation of base to every single Sonos product that is being paired to. But this M here actually is capable of putting out even more power than the Sub. We're talking about 30% more power than the Sub. This guy is putting out 315 watts as opposed to the 245 watts that the Sub was capable of delivering. And if you have the right speakers for this M, it is going to be able to deliver more bass than the Sonos Sub is capable of. So in summary, this Sonos M is important in the Sonos product range because this is how you're going to be able to pair all the different types of speakers, including the big and powerful ones with large cones. And you can be assured that this guy is going to be able to power most of the speakers out there in the market today. The Sonos M is not without its drawbacks and don't buy it until you watch my full video evaluating the Sonos M right here in the link above. In the meantime, enjoy whatever Sonos speakers you have and remember this moment in time, the moment before Sonos moves into high-res territory with its new S2 app and Dolby Atmos with the new Sonos Arc soundbar. If you want to hear me talk about them, consider subscribing to my channel and I'll be dropping those videos over the next couple of days. My Sonos Arc is arriving in a couple of days, so stay tuned and see you soon.